So welcome to OWF 13. Uh, we're here with Gabriele Rufati, uh, the president of OW2. Welcome, Gabriele. Thank you. Thanks for being with us. Uh, so I guess many, many people know about uh, OW2, what it, what it is, but could you just explain maybe to those who, who might not know uh, what, what the consortium is all about? Okay, uh, very briefly, uh, uh, OW2 is a consortium that was founded in 2007, joining a new European uh, a previous consortium named Object Web and uh, a, a Chinese consortium. It's one of the uh, f main five global communities of open source all over the world, and the only one uh, with a, a strong core in Europe, but we have uh, members also in Asia and Latin in, the, in the Americas and in, in China. Uh, OW2 is a, a consortium in the community. Uh, this morning we had uh, um, a, a definition of what an open source community is. And uh, uh, the so definition. The panel of uh, the future of open source uh, yeah, foundations, yeah. right? Okay. And uh, the definition was one possible definition. Uh, an open source community is a, a neutral uh, space for collaboration. And that what uh, OW2 is, uh, is a space for collaboration among individuals, companies, and organizations. And uh, OW2 provides to, to, to support this collaboration uh, a, a three-layer infrastructure, a technology infrastructure to host projects and to have tools to build open source projects a governance infrastructure to manage the community, uh, the license policy, and what you need to manage an open source community, and a communication and marketing infrastructure to advertise about the results of this collaborative effort. Okay, and out of the future of open source foundation panel that, that, uh, that took place just earlier, so what, uh, what's the involvement of OW2 with it, and what was the outcome for you? Yes. Uh, Tomorrow we had, uh, yeah, today we had this panel uh, that it was a, a sort of, uh, we, we, we dis debate together what the future of open source, open source is, uh, 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 there is a f future for these communities and uh, the position of OW2 is, of course, because uh, uh, these communities must do innovation, could help to do innovation. Open source, everyone knows that is the place for real innovation. You can look at cloud computing, at uh, big data, uh, or uh, future internet, all the innovative uh, uh, things are in open source. And through this collaborative uh, uh, effort, uh, open source can help not just to do innovation, because innovation could be also outside the community, out of the boundaries of the communities, but could help to sustain, uh, to give sustainability over time to, um, to innovation, uh, hosting the results, advertising and uh, granting a, 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 a life to the results at the end of the first stage of the project. Right, and tomorrow I think there is another presentation that you have on open source communities where you're gonna more specifically talk about the future of OW2. Y yes, uh, tomorrow I'll try to explain in 50 minutes uh, what the new direction for OW2 because, uh, okay, uh, OW2 is uh, the space for collaboration, but uh, collaboration is not useful for per se. Collaboration must drive, you know, must be a driver of innovation and quality, quality of results. So uh, what's uh, the proposal of W2 is to be exactly the platform for research and development projects, collaborative projects, not just to advertise some specific flagship projects uh, for the um, the members of W2, but to uh, to uh, uh, have a wider collaboration joining uh, academia, university, or uh, European research funded projects with the market, with the industry, to bring the good results that we have, especially in Europe, from the European Commission funded activities, bringing to the market and giving um, uh, sustainability over time. Uh, we are acting with the uh, great results uh, currently in the cloud computing area. 
uh, and we'll, uh, next move is to have a specific initiative in the big data and future internet initiatives. What OW2 uh, like to add is also a way to measure these results because everyone could say I have good results but we need to give evidence and evidence in my opinion is measurement and, uh, but not just measure the software uh, quality code but to use a, a three-dimensional analysis have a, a overall vision of uh, the uh, um, technical results we need good software good results economic results because uh, we must support these results with uh, uh, with an incentive to industry to use it and the social results, what they impact in the customer satisfaction and also in the development, uh, the, in the satisfaction of the developers. And how are you thinking of measuring these results? Uh, in OW2 we have um, already a software quality assurance and trustworthiness uh, program, squad initiative, that uh, currently measure just the software quality. We want to enhance this program to uh, give these wider uh, analysis of performances. So we have the tool, we have the, the methodology just to uh, apply. It's not so easy, but is uh, of course a, a differentiator of the OW2 community among others, um, other commu open source communities. Well, good luck with these exciting uh, initiatives and uh, thank you very much for being with us today. You're welcome. Thank you.